Welcome to Creating Wealth with Jason Hartman. During this program, Jason is going to tell you some really exciting things that you probably haven't thought of before and a new slant on investing. Fresh new approaches to America's best investment that will enable you to create more wealth and happiness than you ever thought possible. Jason is a genuine, self-made, multi-millionaire who not only talks the talk, but walks the walk. He's been a successful investor for 20 years and currently owns properties in 11 states and 17 cities. This program will help you follow in Jason's footsteps on the road to financial freedom. You really can do it. And now, here's your host, Jason Hartman, with the complete solution for real estate investors. Welcome to the Creating Wealth Show. This is episode number 159, and this is your host, Jason Hartman. Hey, we got some great shows coming up after this one. Just want to let you know, next show, number 160, is one of our every 10th shows. And you know what that means. That means we're going to talk about a non-financial topic, but you know, it always seems to somehow relate to finance. And we've got a famous person on show number 160. So tune in. We'll have that up for you real soon. And then number 161, I think we'll be publishing the Michael Gerber show. He is the author of a bunch of famous books. Most of you know him based on his book, The E-Myth, and all of the subsequent books with similar titles. And he is the person who talks about why most businesses don't work and what to do about it. Talks about working working on your business rather than in your business. And he's a very well-known guru on that subject. So I think you'll like that. And we've got about, I think, 28 shows in the queue coming up for you. So we're going to get right to show 200 here pretty quickly before you know it. Anyway, on this show today, what I wanted to do is share with you a preview of our Creating Wealth in Today's Economy boot camp that is an online course. Now, you guys have been asking for this for about two and a half years, I think. And we've just been a little slow at getting around to this. But so many of our clients nowadays are non-local. We're based here in Southern California, and we've had thousands of people come through this program. We've got literally two, maybe three bankers boxes that are totally full, stacked full of testimonials from people that have attended this event. We have everybody fill out an evaluation at the end of the event, and we've got these banker boxes that are full of these things. This has really been our core program for the last five years. And if you want to learn the more in-depth approach, which is on a webinar where you see the visuals, you see the PowerPoint slides, and you hear from a lot of different speakers, this is really for you. And it starts next week and it's only $197. And you'll have it once a week for six weeks. You have the course online. So this is just like University of Phoenix or many top colleges, more traditional colleges, whether they be Stanford, Harvard, they're all doing online courses nowadays. And we're doing the same thing. And the great thing about this is you can listen to it live, or I should say listen to it or watch it live. So if you want to see the visuals, you can be in front of your computer and see all of the visuals. And if you just want to listen on the phone, you can do that. And when you do it live at the time the class is actually happening, you can ask questions and interact with myself and all of the different speakers throughout the six-week course. Or if you can't make it live, you can listen to the recorded version as well. So it's really cool. You're going to get a workbook. The workbook is about 30 pages long. We just had it redesigned and optimized for the online course so you'll get a workbook as well with it and we really recommend that you get signed up for this online course a whole bunch of people have signed up and you know we have listeners in many countries around the world and in many different locations around North America so we've got that for you and here is just a preview of that course and by the way I hope to see you at the master's weekend so let's go to the preview of creating wealth in today's economy boot camp here we go Well, welcome, everybody. My name is Jason Hartman, and I'm president of the Platinum Properties Investor Network. Tonight, we'd like to talk to you about something that you have all been asking for for quite a few years, actually, about two and a half years, I'm going to say, maybe three even, and that is that we take the Creating Wealth Boot Camp and we turn it into an online course. 
We've offered this event live to people for, oh gosh, five years, I guess now, five and a half years even. And we've had about 8,000 people attend this program. And this is the first time we'll be offering it as, a, as an online course. So I appreciate you joining us. What we wanted to do tonight is introduce a few people that will be speaking throughout the course. You'll hear a little bit from them about their specialty. Most of them who are on the call tonight are our local market specialists that help keep track of real estate investments in other cities around the country. And I'll review the course, kind of the syllabus of the course, and just kind of dig into what this is all about. It's a six-week course, and it will be for approximately an hour, one night a week for six weeks, and it starts next week. We're having our semi-annual event, I should say, the Masters Weekend, which is this weekend here in Costa Mesa, and that's a live event. And then right afterwards, we'll start with the Creating Wealth in Today's Economy Boot Camp that will be an online course. So let me just kind of do a little bit of a round robin here real quickly, and I want to introduce a couple people to you and have them tell you a little bit about what they'll be talking about throughout the course throughout the six weeks. And we'll dig deeper into learning about specific real estate markets. We'll dig deeper into market selection. We'll talk about a couple of the things you heard before we started the call tonight, and that is packaged commodities investing and a whole bunch of the other concepts. So I'll talk about that. But first, I wanted to just start with some introductions here. And I want to first introduce Eric, who is in Atlanta, Georgia. And Eric, it's about 9.15 p.m there, right? Are you there? Uh, it's 9.15. I'm, I'm, I'm rocking and rolling now. Well, good. Thanks for joining us tonight. Just if you would, tell all of the people on the call, Eric, about what you'll be talking about during the course. We'll have you on one time during the six-week program, and you can talk a little bit about your market. I know we'll go into further detail, and we'll teach people about the investment opportunities in your market and several other markets, too. For one, I'd certainly appreciate the opportunity to work with you all and then additionally uh, see if I can share any knowledge or information that I have on my end. Basically, what we'll be summarizing is, is why we think the Atlanta market is, uh, is a great opportunity as far as investment goes, mainly because we have a low price point and, and a solid uh, rental rate, which really provides a great cash flow opportunity. I think one thing that investors are very excited about that, that we offer that not many other places do is a, a low money down program. And uh, I don't know how in detail you want me to get, but basically it's an opportunity where you put $5,000 down on a, on a property and then we, we finance the property ourselves. And then uh, we actually pre-approve you with a lender so that um, you're able to refinance into a loan without having to put any additional funds down except for closing costs on that loan. So it's basically an opportunity to, to get a, a positive cash flowing property only putting $5,000 down plus closing costs. So uh, that's, yeah. that's been a very popular tool. I, I do have to say, and we've been doing a lot of business with that, Eric, because $5,000 down in positive cash flow is pretty much a miracle. Those are some very interesting opportunities and they're creative opportunities. And I'm sure a lot of people on the call are very worried about what's going on in the economy today. I know I talk to people every day who, who say that. They don't believe there's a recovery going on. I don't really believe there's a recovery per se, as the government would have you believe it is. Uh, there is a sort of a recovery and sort of not a recovery at the same time. But you've got some unique opportunities there, and I can't wait to explore that. Now, I don't believe Brittany has scheduled everybody for a specific time during the course, but over the course of the six weeks, we will have you on. We'll discuss these opportunities in detail. We'll analyze properties. We'll talk about why this market is good. We'll talk about why other markets are good and about a bunch of our investment techniques as well. So, Eric, anything else you want to say? No, I mean, uh, you know, obviously, if I can share anything throughout, if anybody has any questions, that uh, I'll be happy to answer beforehand as well. But look forward to working with you, and we'll look forward to getting together here in the next six weeks. Excellent. Well, thank you much. I wanted to now have Kathy come on the line with us, 
And Kathy is a speaker who has spoken at every single one of our Master's Weekend events so far. And she teaches two subjects in great detail, and she just does an excellent job at it. One of them is 1031 Exchange, and the other one is called The Power of Analysis. And we've had her at the Creating Wealth Bootcamp before, but with this being an online course, it's easier to line all these people up from all of these different areas and all of these different specialties. So it's sort of like a, a, you get a little taste of Master's Weekend as well. And Kathy, are you there? Yes, I am. Excellent. Well, thanks for joining us. Kathy, one of the great things about income property investing is that it's really the most tax-favored asset in America. I mean, there isn't anything that offers better tax benefits than real estate and income property. And people can basically go throughout their whole lives buying real estate, selling real estate, making profits on real estate, but continually deferring the tax on that. And taxes are the largest expense anybody has in their life. Tell us a little bit about what people will be learning as far as 1031 exchanges and and not paying the government, which is one of the things I love, not paying Uncle Sam. (laughs) Good. Thank you, Jason. The series that we're going to be doing, we'll be talking about the benefits and understanding the process of a 1031 exchange. The IRS has had this section in the code for many, many years in which an investor who owns investment property is able to defer the capital gains tax that they would have to pay if they follow some very specific rules and invest in a property of like time following those rules. The real benefit you can see pretty quickly when you look at calculating what your capital gains tax would be. So we go through the process of calculating capital gains, looking at not only federal but state, and then we look at calculating depreciation, which is kind of that ugly surprise that comes in when you sell investment property, the benefit being that you're able to defer all of those three things, state, federal, and recapture depreciation under Section 1031. It's a wonderful benefit for creating wealth long-term. And there are things, Kathy, that people really need to know. I mean, they make a lot of mistakes from time to time doing these exchanges, and they lose that tax deferral benefit, don't they? Yeah, they do. There's some real, there are three basic points that I present in the class that are absolutely, totally important for you to understand. If you don't understand the basic rules of 100% tax deferral, you have the possibility, if you don't follow those rules, of having what's called boot. And that is you are going to pay some tax to the extent that you have recognized gain if you have a reduction in debt or you take any cash out from the sale of your relinquished property. So we'll discuss those calculations and and really understand what a 100% tax deferred exchanges versus a partial exchange where you do have boot and you will have to pay some tax. A couple little quick tricks of the trade I'd like you to just address quickly if you can, Kathy, that investors should know. Number one is that they can sell one property and buy many properties, right? Yes, you can do a multi-property exchange. Very common to sell three condos put them all together, add all their equity and debt together, and then go out and buy one apartment building. Or vice versa, have an apartment building and go out and buy a piece of raw land and two investment, residential investment properties. So you can do multi-property exchanges both ways. And that's very common, and it's a great investment strategy. And I've done that strategy with your company myself, and i got to say it was just wonderful to sell a property, and I purchased three out of my exchange, and so far they haven't collected a penny in tax from me on any of those, and I did it completely within the IRS rules and everything. So, Well, you can diversify uh, by not only type but by location. Mm-hmm. So you can go to multiple locations and buy, and have multiple types of investment property. So it's very broad, and it's it's really fun. Yeah, it sure is. One more thing on tricks of the trade, Kathy, a reverse exchange. Tell people about that and the benefit real quickly, if you would. Okay. Right now, we see a lot of investors sitting out there with cash, and they want to seize the moment. They want to buy something now, and they haven't even put up their their relinquished property, their property they own. They haven't even thought about selling it yet. The benefit of a reverse exchange is that you can – 
give the qualified intermediary asset preservation my company your money and we go out and buy that replacement property for you. We hold it in an entity for a total of 180 days and during that 180 days you then sell your relinquished property and you in turn then pay us back for the money we invested for you to buy this property, we deed it to you, and you complete a 100% tax-deferred exchange. Because the golden rule in a 1031 exchange is you cannot own both properties at the same time. So you give us the cash, and we go out and buy that property for you, which is a great, great, great strategy to seize the moment because there are a lot of great deals out there with positive cash flow and great after-tax benefits. That's excellent. And Kathy, thank you so much. I will see you on Saturday. You're speaking at the Masters Weekend doing two components, and one is on exchange and the other one's on the power of analysis. So we'll look forward to seeing you on Saturday, okay? I look forward to it. Thank you, Jason. Thanks. I wanted to have Phil from Dallas come on the line if we could. I'm a big fan of Dallas. I know a lot of you are listeners to the podcast, and you can find that at jasonhartman.com, by the way. And Dallas has just been a really good market, a lot of great investments. And again, our people that are talking to you on this six-week course are basically doing rehab properties. They're doing pure straight brokerage. Some of the properties are rehab properties. Some of them are new properties. Many of them are bank REOs and foreclosures. So it just varies the gamut. And in every different market around the country, you've got to take a different approach because every market is unique. The old saying in real estate is that all real estate is local. Phil, are you there? I am. Good All right, Phil. How are you? How, how are I'm doing? Well, how are well you you're doing? you're actually not in Dallas right now. You're probably in Northern California, right? I am. I am. I'm in Northern California. It's just about six thirty here. Excellent. Well, tell us about what people will learn throughout the course about the Dallas market, if you would. Well, the first thing that they're going to learn, and and to some people it's going to be a surprise and to others it's not, but I know there's a lot of talk about recession and all that stuff in the rest of the country, and actually Texas as a whole, there is no recession. Uh, It's actually quite the opposite. We're going to probably reach a a statewide budget surplus of about $17 billion this year. So Texas is doing things right, and what we do as a company is we provide pretty much a turnkey investment opportunity for investors where to take advantage of the foreclosure market in Dallas. We want to take advantage of the mood and get the great deals on the properties, but we also want to take advantage of an area that there is no recession and the cash flows are are really good, outstanding return on investment opportunities. So in a nutshell, I don't know how you know how detailed you want me to get into the process. I know we'll touch on that at some point in the next six weeks. But Yeah, you really, really refined the process very well. I'm, I'm just totally impressed with your company and the way they do it. When I was in Dallas a couple of months ago, I toured around with your people, and wow, what an impressive operation they got. We looked at a whole bunch of different properties, and to see the way they do construction and they do rehab and use the same pieces in multiple properties, so they get huge economies of scale. And boy, that is just a very impressive system that you've got. So now, you'll be at the Masters Weekend on, I believe, are you speaking on Sunday, Phil? Um, I'll be there on Saturday. On Saturday, okay. Well, we'll look forward to seeing you Saturday. And is there anything else? You know, I totally agree with you, by the way. There's no recession in Texas. Texas bucks the trend a lot of times. (laughs) Anything else you want people to know, just in closing real quickly? Yeah, just real quick, uh, just, you know, thanks for for giving us a chance to talk to you, and we look forward to talking with you guys over over the next six weeks at some point. All right. Thanks so much for joining us tonight. Okay, what we've got is we're going to learn throughout this six-week course, we're going to talk about moving from active to passive income as quickly as possible. One of our strategies to do that that some of you are familiar with, some aren't, is called refi till you die, refi till you die, and that's sort of a strategy that we trademarked to pull cash out of properties, live on that cash without having to sell them because you never want to kill that golden goose, do you? You want to keep that golden goose producing those golden eggs uh, throughout your lifetime. And you can do that and you can do it in a tax-free methodology. So we will talk about that in depth throughout the six-week course. And one of the nice things about this course is just like a live course, we'll have the PowerPoint slides, we'll have images, 
on your computer screen. If you're not able to tune in at the time that the class is offered, you can take it at your own convenience. You can listen to the recorded version, but when you're on the live version, you can interact with all of the different speakers and instructors. You can ask questions and all of that type of stuff. So just like a live online college course through University of Phoenix or many of the most reputable universities around the world, they're all doing this online training, and it's a great way because you can hear the program once, you can listen to it repeatedly, and of course on the live version you can ask questions. We'll learn about the Ten Commandments of Successful Investing. We'll learn how to truly calculate return on investment in a rental property, and we'll learn how to calculate what I call return on inflation, a second kind of ROI where you can actually get paid to borrow money. It's a pretty neat opportunity like that. And let's talk to another one of these speakers. And since it's late there, why don't we have Mary Lane from Columbia, South Carolina come on because she's three hours later than us and probably wants to get to bed soon. Mary oh. Lane, are you there? I'm here. Hey, good to talk to you and to hear your wonderful southern accent. <laughs> <laughs> good to talk to you too, Jason. We've had a lot of clients purchase from you in Columbia, South Carolina, and do that in these student housing opportunities. Yes. And what's really interesting, Mary Lane, is you know I'm a big fan of student housing because the next 10 years, the demographics just cannot be wrong about student housing. We've got Gen Y. That's the largest demographic cohort in the history of America. It's mm -hmm. larger than the baby boomers. It's 80 million people versus the baby boomers at 76 million people. And guess what? All of those kids are coming into their prime college years and their prime young adult renting years. So right. student housing is a great opportunity. Now, I was out there to visit you not too long ago, and you showed me around, and we looked at some of the student housing properties. One of these great areas that sort of has this whole turnkey lifestyle solution for students. Tell us about it. First of all, we are delighted to work with Platinum Properties and all of your investors. And Columbia is a great little niche market for student housing. You know, we've got the University of South Carolina as well as some other smaller colleges in town and we, we have a strong rental market, especially with the student population. The project that we have that has gotten a lot of interest from your investors it's completely hands-off investing. You know, you buy it, there's an on-site property management, and, and the unique thing about this property is they have had a 0% unoccupancy rate, which I don't think I've ever seen anywhere else. <laughs> ever since they've opened their doors, they've had 100% occupancy all the time, which is great news to investors and awesome for the pocketbook. And you know what's interesting, Mary Lane, and this is how small the world is nowadays. One of the girls that works at my gym here in Newport mm -hmm. Beach, California, actually is going to the University of South Carolina. And I was talking to her one day, and I said, well, gosh, I've got the perfect place for you to live. <laughs> and I told her about it, and she says, oh, I already rented a room there. Yeah. <laughs> and I thought, what a small world that is. So she yeah. totally verified everything that you and our own investors, our clients, have really said is that she said that she was actually renting a room here with four other girls in one of these cute little brand new houses oh, yeah. and paying $480 per month, which is actually mm -hmm. higher than what we project them, them renting for. That's really good. Anything else people should know about Columbia? Well, I just think Columbia, you know, a lot of times we're not one of those big cities like Atlanta or Dallas, and I think we get overlooked a lot of times, but we are an investor's best friend. I mean, we've got the three things, and normally they say, if, you know, if, if, a, if a market has one of these, it's probably a good place for an investor. We have state and local government. We have local schools, you know, a state university, and we have a strong military force. All three of those make an impeccable rental market, and we have that. And I um, think Columbia is a great place to invest. I personally invest here, and um, I look forward to speaking with any investor that you bring our way that has questions and hopefully getting them plugged into the Columbia market. Excellent. Thank you so much, Mary Lane, and we will talk to you soon. Great. Thanks, Jason. Have a good night. So if you've ever thought, how am I going to retire with what's going on in the economy? And you know what? That's a good question. That's a serious question. If you didn't accomplish 
all of the dreams you had in life yet, if there's still a lot of stuff on your bucket list, if you want to sit back and you want to collect checks and have passive income, that's what income property is really all about. And one of the other speakers that we'll have throughout this six-week course is Zach, and I wanted to get Zach on the line. He's in St. Robert, Missouri, and he's got a very interesting opportunity in brand new construction with low down payments. Zach, are you there? I am here. Hey, how are you doing? I'm doing great. Thanks for having me on, Jason. Well, my pleasure. Tell us a little bit about your market. I mean, again, it's kind of like Columbia. It's one of these small markets that people kind of overlook. But I tell you, what's going on right now is that all of the big cities, the famous cities that people are always thinking about, those are the ones mostly having all the problems. Los Angeles, New York, Washington, D.C., San Francisco. These markets are have not been doing well for years. And oddly enough, we're based here in Orange County, California. It's a beautiful place to live. The weather's nice. But boy, I tell you, you wouldn't want to be an investor here. I know lots of people that have just been wiped out financially here. And in your market, St. Robert, is one of these places people never really think of, do they? But there's some really good opportunities there, huh? There is, and it definitely flies under the radar and doesn't pick up on a lot of people's I don't know, investment agenda because it's not the big-name city like you were talking about. It's definitely a, a big plus. You don't have the big run-up uh, peak of value and the big troughs afterwards, obviously, that we are seeing in so many of the large metropolitan areas. Thank you for listening to the Creating Wealth Show. This is Jason Hartman, your host, and we appreciate you following the show. We have many, many episodes, hundreds of episodes, and some of the older episodes have been archived and placed in our members section, and that applies to this one. So we include a sample that's about 25 minutes long, and then for the rest of the show, you can go to our members section at jasonhartman.com. Many of the other shows are still in their full-length, complete version. However, some of the shows, like this one, are in our member section where you can hear the show in its entirety. And again, you just need to go to jasonhartman.com and you can get the full show there in the member section, plus a whole bunch of other great members, benefits, and resources, whether it be documents, forms, contracts, articles, other video and audio content, just a great resource. So be sure to join as a member at jasonhartman.com. And thanks again for listening to The Creating Wealth Show. This show is produced by the Hartman Media Company, all rights reserved. For distribution or publication rights and media interviews, please visit www.hartmanmedia.com or email media at hartmanmedia.com. Nothing on this show should be considered specific personal or professional advice. Please consult an appropriate tax, legal, real estate, or business professional for individualized advice. Opinions of guests are their own, and the host is acting on behalf of Platinum Properties Investor Network, Inc., exclusively.